Welcome to Pro Ebcast News, where we bring you daily industry updates. Today is Monday, May 17th, and you're watching the Afternoon Update with Sarah Fletcher. Today's news is sponsored by American Retirement Systems, providing competitive solutions for agents and advisors. For more information, visit www.americanretirementsystems.com. Now for today's headlines. The price per barrel for oil this morning declined $1.32 or 1.84% to $70.29 on the New York Mercantile Exchange. Earlier in the day, the cost of the commodity dipped as low as $69.82, the lowest figure since a figure of $69.50 a barrel on February 5th. Meanwhile, prices at the pump dipped for the 11th straight day, Motorist Group AAA reports. investment news, General Motors this morning announced that the automaker turned its first profit since 2007. In fact, in the first quarter, GM earned $865 million on revenue of $31.5 billion. Although the company last year not lost nearly $6 billion on revenue on only $22.4 billion and had reported losses the two previous quarters since emerging from bankruptcy, this first quarter profit was anticipated due to a recent increase in sales. In long-term care news, as of June 1st, physicians will experience a 21% cut in Medicare reimbursements unless Congress votes to pass a patch sometime in the next two weeks. Current legislature requires that the payment rates for doctors who accept Medicare be adjusted annually based on economic stability, and reports indicate that the economy is far from recovery. This is significant news, seeing as doctors may have to drop some of the 43 million Americans who are covered under Medicare in an effort to make ends meet. I'm Sarah Fletcher, and thanks for watching ProBcast News. For more in-depth news and features, visit producersweb.com.